Hello, this is Stu with Productive Computing demonstrating the recipe on how to supercharge the FileMaker CRM. Whether you are new to programming or you are advanced enough to create your own FileMaker template, you are going to love how simple it can be to go from zero records to serving up a fully functional FileMaker Google integration. This could be for your personal solution or for your clients. Everything you will see can be done for free with the plugin for 30 days. After that, the license is very affordable, especially after you see and get a taste of what can be done with this recipe. Mark has already done an excellent thorough overview of the FileMaker CRM. The FileMaker CRM is like a template, which is kind of like a cookie cutter. And cookie cutters need to be connected to great cookie dough to serve up something truly delicious. You or a client of yours could have a ton of dough in Google Contacts, Calendar, Tasks, etc. And the FileMaker CRM is a great cookie cutter. Now you just have to get those together. And here's how you do it. As with any recipe, especially a supercharged recipe, we're going to need to have some ingredients. And the first ingredient you're going to need is from the FileMaker website. Just click on the Learn tab and then download the CRM app. Try the sample. You'll fill in some of your information and it will take you to a download screen and the downloaded file will look much like this. A very slick file with places for contacts, clients, opportunities, a dashboard. You can even go under the hood to see their custom functions, which they have some really cool ones there. And you can see their scripts here under the hood, but there are a couple of blank spaces in the CRM that we need to supercharge. The next ingredient you're going to need is the free G Manipulator demo from Productive Computing. You can get that by going to the plugin section on our website and scroll to the plugin demo download. You want to install and register, but before you authenticate, you're going to want a free Google account. I have my Google account set up with 51 contacts in already. Now we're finally ready to authenticate and it's going to ask which account you want. So I'm going to click that. I'm going to click allow and it has completed. And so we come back to FileMaker authentication is successful. And with just that alone, when we go back to our custom CRM and we look at our scripts, we see we have one of the two blank spaces filled with all kinds of custom script steps, but we still have one more blank space to supercharge. So we have all of our ingredients. Oh, except one. And that would be a smile. And there you go. Now we're ready. Every recipe needs a few directions and we'll go through them step by step. Very simple. The first one is to delete all records in the free CRM. They already have a few records for dashboard, clients, contacts, and opportunities. So we simply want to get rid of these records that are not ours. So we are going to delete all records and because they set up their relationships as a cascade delete, then we know we have the other ones done except for interactions. So we'll get rid of those also. Step one is complete. Step two in the directions, copy and paste one table. This table is found in the demo and this table that we want is the folders contact. So we copy that, we go back to our custom CRM, we paste that table in to fields done. 
Now we just need to gently mix in two fields. And since we are bringing in the clients, we're going to attach them to the client table using the same naming structure. We added a Google ID and the contact folder. The next one is to add one button. Since we are importing our clients from Google, we'll go to the client screen and we'll simply move this button over a little bit. We'll add another one and we'll call this get Google. But this is not the right script. So for now, we're gonna have to make that do nothing and we'll slide these over. And our fourth step is complete. We are ready for the next step, which is copy and paste three scripts. We are going to copy these three scripts from the demo file. We want the plugin checker, the get contact folders, and the contact pull scripts. So we copy those, go to our CRM and paste, and we have pasted in the only three scripts we need for this particular step. Oh, but it did say to gingerly modify a few lines, so I will do that now. Very minor changes, just looking for anything that might need a field name changed or maybe a different layout from what was used in the demo file, which we can see very clearly where those are, so I'll make those changes. Since we have completed that step, we have just one step left, which is to carefully click the button and watch closely to make sure it doesn't burn. We have assigned the new script that we copied, the contact pull script, which was one of the ones we copied and slightly modified. So we are ready to click it and watch closely for a few seconds. And there it is, 51 contacts, which just so happens to be how many contacts we have on the Google side. If we look up that particular one, private properties, and we look at their information, we can see the addresses are the same. We can even add another contact and we'll call this company the triple quadruple a supercharged company and we save that they are done and when we come back to our supercharged crm we can scroll through our list and see there is the quadruple a supercharged company this particular recipe does have additional options of allowing push, pull, delete of clients, contacts, tasks, calendar, and mail. This demonstrates that in just a few minutes, you can have a potential client that is currently using Google. You can switch things and instantly have an awesome CRM there, ready, navigating, and pulling all of their current clients that will wow them into wanting your service. If you want to demonstrate it to another client, there are some very simple reheating directions. You simply disconnect the authentication and then authenticate with another client. This is found in the demo file in the disconnect button. And this free supercharged recipe has a serving size of about 1 billion monthly that are using Google accounts. And that is how you can supercharge the free CRM FileMaker app by using the G Manipulator plugin, which is now sugar free. Feel free to share this recipe with anyone you like. And don't forget to check out our YouTube channel and Productive Computing University, where we have other training courses to help you save time and money.